All right, drivers behind the lines. Let's get this match started in three, two, one, go. Match 30 off to an exciting start. All robots are moving. We've got two game pieces scored on the blue side, three on the red side. Only one is able to engage. That is a bonus for the blue, so they come in with the lead in the autonomous mode. With this 21 point lead, the Blue Alliance looks to capitalize. Focusing in the middle of the field, we've got lots of robots picking up cubes, moving them to the opposite side. Meanwhile, the Blue Alliance is working with cones mostly. We'll see how this switches about halfway through the match as they go from cubes to cones and cones to cubes. We see lots of robots have found themselves to be specialized for a certain specific type of game piece. A lot of times they talk with their alliance partners before the match to make sure they've got a cohesive strategy to maximize their gameplay, get as many links as they can, score as many points and RPs as possible. As 5010 places a cone in the mid section, 5188 grabs one from their human player shelf screams across the field, barely even stopping on its way to put that cone up on the high grid. All robots are highly functional and contributing to the match so far. It's pretty tight. Only 20 points separate these two appliances. They're not appliances, they're alliances. Blue hanging on to that lead that they established during the autonomous mode. Other than that, in Teleop, it's been pretty even. As we enter the end game portion of the match. Red Alliance has tied it up and then some. They've already got two robots on looking for the... Nope, 5010, fake me out. They are going to score more points. Blue, on the other hand, looking to see if they can get that triple climb. They have two robots on and balance so far. 2171 might need to join them. Nope, they're just gonna hang out. They're gonna get the two park parking points and call it good. Score is up, and we see the winner is the Blue Alliance. By one point, Red Pride Robotics takes over the second place. 5010 falls to seven, 76, 17 falls to eight. We're only about halfway through, so these are gonna be still pretty volatile as we go throughout the competition. But as we get closer and closer to the end, these rankings matter more and more.